Come to me, all you who are weary and burdened, and I will give you rest. Take my yoke upon you and learn from me, for I am gentle and humble in heart, and you will find rest for your souls. For my yoke is easy and my burden is light. Good morning. These are some comforting words from our Savior Jesus, aren't they? I think they're so comforting. Maybe you do too, because, well, over the course of a day, you know, no matter what day we're in, it feels like at some point we feel, at least I feel, tired, right? Or, yeah, how, is, how are you doing? And you may answer, I'm feeling tired. And Well, that's because there's things to do, right? There's, there's always something else to do. There's always something else to be done. There's always going to be work to do. And that can leave us feeling mentally, physically tired. Ah, but when it comes to the work that truly matters, getting to heaven, well, that work, that work's done. Rest assured, that work is complete. Jesus took it upon himself, and I do this devotion today here in church, sitting in a pew, because, well, this is one of the places where I find great rest. To come and sit and hear the words of God, you know, spoken through Pastor Z as he says, I forgive you. I love you. You're still my child. And what comfort and what rest, rest, ease for my soul, ease for my mind that that gives. Jesus says to us, come to me. Come to me, all you who are weary and burned. Well, we feel tired. It's what happens as we go through our days. Jesus says, come to me. Come to me. Listen, I'm here for you. I'm here to give advice. I'm here to give comfort. I'm here to give love. Listen, come to me in prayer. I'm also here to listen to you. Bring those burns. Bring whatever's making you tired. Bring them to me. And rest assured, you will find rest in me. And so whether you're watching this at the beginning of your day and you know what's on your to-do list, your checklist, already making you tired, well, rest assured, you are in God's hands. You're still his child. Nothing will change that. If you're watching this at the end of the day and you look back and now you're feeling tired, well, rest assured, you're in God's hands. The work is done. For all of us, the work is done. That's beautiful. It's comforting. And it gives us that ease of mind, ease for our souls, no matter how we're feeling, no matter how we go about our day. Let's pray. Dear Lord, we... Thank you for taking the work upon yourself, for completing everything needed for our salvation, giving it to us for free, and knowing that what is ours is truly beautiful. And allow us, as we feel tired, as we feel tired through our days and weeks and months, Lord, we ask that you give us rest. Allow us to come to you to hear your words of forgiveness and words of love. And allow us to come to you in prayer, to know that we can always go to you, our Heavenly Father, who listens to us. And we do so now, praying in our Savior Jesus' name. Amen. Uh, just one announcement. If you want to help with the Bible Olympics coming up February 20th, uh, let me know. Fun day. And um, if you know of any children, come invite a friend ages uh, four and up. Uh, come, it should be a fun, fun day. If you have any questions about it or need some more information, you can contact me. That's all for now. God bless your day.